Hello students! In this ELC video, we're going to look at Assessment 2. You will find out the main details about the assessment, some tips about organisation, some reminders about supporting evidence and referencing, and some more reminders about submission. Watch the video so that you know about Assessment 2 and get a good grade. OK, so first, what do you need to do in this assessment? OK, so Assessment 2 is a problem solution essay. It continues from Draft 1, Assessment 1. Now, in Assessment 2, you have to write about 900 to 1,000 words. You need to include a narrowed essay title, an introduction, body paragraphs covering the problem and proposed solutions, a conclusion and a reference list in the appropriate referencing style for your discipline. Write next some tips about organisation. Please pay attention to topic sentences. The topic sentence should be the controlling idea of the paragraph. By reading a topic sentence, your teacher and any reader should have a very clear idea of what the paragraph is about. Try to include paragraph hooks as well. A paragraph hook links between your paragraphs and improves overall organisation. Also, try to end each paragraph with a concluding sentence that links back to the topic sentence. This will also help with your organisation. Next, supporting evidence and referencing. OK, so remember, you should have supporting evidence which uses reliable and academic articles. Your main sources should come from academic journal articles and books. You can also use newspaper articles, magazine articles and government websites. But you cannot only use newspaper articles. And your reference list is graded in this assessment, so make sure you get it right. Look at the ELC referencing guides for more information. OK, finally. Reminders about submission. Please do check Blackboard for the due date for the assessment or ask your teacher. You need to submit the assessment on Blackboard via Turnitin. A final tip. Submit early and look at the Turnitin similarity report. Then change your essay as necessary. Use Turnitin as a tool to improve your essay. OK, that's it from me. Continue working on assessment too and remember, have fun at university.